I S U P K. Hey, Shalom, man. It's Priest Kevin in Doha with the I S U P K. And the Commander Journey in Holland, California, man. So, all blacks, Hispanics, and native Indians, subscribe to this channel, man. You want true salvation? You're going to learn from the priests and prophets of the I S U P K, man. Subscribe to that channel. Hit that button, man. And it's there with that. Shalom. culture man right. and the Christian church pushes America's uh, America's toxic uh, culture and right. drug culture man right. America's America's culture and America's Christianity is a virus for black and Latino lives right. they don't tell the truth if we actually read the Bible see what God wanted we will live a better life right. go ahead and read brother Deuteronomy 28 verse 1 and it shall come to pass if thou shalt hearken diligently unto the voice of the Lord thy God. If you're going to hearken diligently, if you actually, go, if, you, if we, if we actually listen to God and follow God's commandments, what is the reward? The pastor never talks about the reward. If we, if we change our life, if we follow the commandments of God, right. read unto the voice of the Lord thy God to observe and to do all His commandments. That's that that's that's a big hiccup. Today, the church, is not the, te the church does not teach what God requires from us. Right. God requires a certain moral and statute from us. Right. We cannot walk around and do whatever the hell we want to and think God is still going to love us. Right. And still think that God, and still think that we can receive heaven. You have to please God. And, to and today, Christianity, Christians have made God seem like a punk. Right. And today, Christians make God seem like God works for us. When it's the other way around. God don't work for us. We work for him, man. We are, we are the servants of God. God ain't our servant. Go in. To observe and to do all his commandments, which I commanded thee this day. What are those commandments? If you read the Bible, the Lord don't want us to eat pork, crash up, or lobster, man. If you read the Bible, God don't want us to get high, man. If you read the Bible, God does not want us to be homosexual, man. If you read the Bible, God does not want our daughters to be whores and prostitutes, man. But what? But what? But what? America pays our daughters to pose naked in magazines. America pays our sons to rap about drugs and make millions off the drugs in the rap industry, man. Someone, someone is a devil on the earth. That is evil, man. To pay us, to pay us millions to sing to sing songs about us getting high. Right. To pay our daughters millions to pose naked in a magazine and to shake and to shake her and to shake her, shake her behind and make a music video called WAP. And we get paid and we gonna get paid millions off of that. It is ridiculous, man. And we are sitting against God by doing that. We, if, if you actually, if you actually 
want a result from God, if you want a reward from God, we gotta work for him, man. That's right. We gotta please God. What are we gonna what are we doing to please God? Not a damn thing. You know why? Because the Christian church has not taught us how to please God. The Christian church has taught us how to be a good servant in America. How to please white Jesus, man. Go ahead. That the Lord thy God will set thee on high above all nations of the earth. Wait a minute, let's start over again. You mean to tell me the reward of the reward of following God is God giving you some authority on earth? Is God setting you above how? Making you royalty? Making you a king? Over, 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 over giving you some authority over, over the land? I didn't learn that at church. Church told me that we just, if we just hold hands with everybody else and give hugs and kisses, we'd be good and just give, be good people. Jesus will love you. Jesus loves all. The church are liars and they cannot prove that in the Bible. The IGBK is out here today proving the things that we say right out of the Bible. And you got that Bible at home, black man. You just got you just got to blow the dust off of it and open it. Crack it open and read. See, 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 what are we saying? I, I actually take notes. Go home and open it. And then come back the next day and say, you know what? You guys lied to us. I opened up my Bible and didn't say that. Or you're going to come back and say, you know what? I opened up my Bible and it was saying exactly the same thing which our brothers were saying. Y'all brothers is right. Go ahead, read from the top. And it shall come to pass if thou shalt hearken diligently unto the voice of the Lord thy God to observe and to do all his commandments. If we do all his commandments, man, we got to please God. Just like black men, if you got children, you know your children have to do what? Be obedient to you, to please you. When you, when you, when you. when you are pleased with your children, it's because your child is making honor roll. Your child is making good grades. When you are pleased by your child, you're pleased by your child because your child is taking out the trash, washing the dishes, and, do, and, and being obedient to you. Now God we, are, we please God by being obedient to God. Right. Today, we're not, uh, on Sunday, we are not taught how to be obedient to God. Right. That's what the eyes should be That's what we are here now teaching us, teaching us how to be obedient to God and how, and, how, and, how, and, how, and how to get God to become the enemy of our enemies, man. That's right. Go ahead and read. Come. Which I command thee this day that the Lord thy God will set thee on high. That's the reward. If we follow God, the Lord is going to do what? The Lord is going to do what? Set thee on high above all nations of the earth. Above all nations of the earth. The Lord, the Lord didn't say you're going to die and go to heaven, man. The Lord said if you obey me, I'm going to set you above high on the earth. Above all nations, man. That's right. You know why? Because you got evil rulers and you got righteous rulers, man. Right now, America's, uh, right now, America's being ran by evil rulers, man. And we need a ruler of God to run the earth so, every, so everybody can rejoice in a righteous ruler. Right now, America is mourning over a disgusting ruler, man. Donald Trump was a disgusting ruler, and guess what? You surprised. Guess what? Barack Obama was too. Bill Clinton was too. All the American presidents are wicked rulers. Because you know why? They're against God, man. Read it again. And it shall come to pass, if thou shalt hearken diligently unto the voice of the Lord thy God. Black man, if we are tired of being shot dead in the streets, if we're tired of having drugs put in our community, if we are tired of being dis dis uh, dis dis discriminated against, man, this is what we must do. Read. Unto the voice of the Lord thy God to observe and to do all his commandments. We gotta please God and be obedient. We gotta observe and do his commandments, man. That's right. Meaning what? No more of a, no more of America's drugs. No more of the white man drugs, man. And we should know by now, America's using that for a game for us. They give us the drugs, we sell it, then they lock us up for life. It's a stupid game to be playing. And you know what? You know, you know why we play that game? We play that game because we, we, we live in a poverty. So we're like, hell, why not? I'm, I'm, I'm trying to go to school. I'm trying to get a job. I can't get hired. Why not sell some drugs? And you know what? We fall for the game every time. And, they, and the white man know what he's doing? Because we poor. So we play that game, man. Today we say we're not going to play that game no more, man. We're not going to play the game of, I'll give you this amount of money 
to be a to be a homosexual. Right. We're not gonna play the game where it's though America gives a certain amount of money to be a drug dealer. A woman is not gonna play the game no more when it's though America gives her money to be a certain amount of money to be a whore. And then she influences all little girls and all little daughters to be whores, man. Right. That's the game America has played on our people, black man. And if you want to change that, we gotta come back to God. Go ahead, brother. That's right. Let's give him, brother, a powerful hand. My whole life was trying to find something to follow. Had loyalty, every man tried to borrow. Felt pain and a lot of sorrow. Got betrayed, so packed. I didn't even have my heart broke. Living confused, about to lose hope. Cops got me on the side of the road like a sideshow. Need an antidote before I croak. Now I'm setting fire to rhythm man blues for this guitar smoke. Rebel with no cause, trying to find direction. The world got me vexed. Picked up a bad lick of habit that's hereditary from oppression. Felt like my life was on fire trying to find an exit. Now look, 10 G's plus a good wreck. Sometimes a follower is a soldier trying to find a good ship. Plus, when you in hell, how do you excel? Wisdom, the breath of life, I don't believe in fairy tale. Listen well to what I tell. No calling can cause pain. Something that a rebel knows very well. Can't you tell I was sent from the Lord? Got a tongue like a two-edged sword.